This is Calico, my four-month-old Cocker Spaniel, who was just about seven pounds, weighed just about seven pounds at the time of filming this. She was weaned onto commercial kibble, unfortunately, at I think about five weeks of age, but when I got her at seven and a half weeks, I immediately put her on raw food, and she's had none of the problems that puppies sometimes have, like diarrhea and bloating, and she's slim and trim. Here she's using her back teeth to bite off pieces of the meat and bone. When dogs have their food cut up for them, they uh, can sometimes develop bad breath, and it's because the food particles lodge in their teeth and putrefy, and that's what produces the bad breath. It doesn't mean that teeth are going to decay or that organ function is going to be jeopardized like we're sometimes told by vets. It's just a bad smell. My last dog had that problem because he was not crate trained, so I did cut his food up for him, but he died at age 19 with no dental problems ever and a full set of teeth. And I'll point out at the end of the video that Kelly does get some of this bone, even though the bone's very hard. She's got very sharp little needle teeth, and she does manage to get some of the bone as well as the meat. But this is what keeps teeth clean. It's a very natural, normal way for dogs to eat. She does also get consumable bone. This is the bone after Callie has already gotten most of the meat off of it. And as you can see, she has gotten some of the bone. It's not a lot, but it's possibly enough to offset all of the um, all of the meat she, she's gotten and there's you know lots of teeth cleaning benefits to be had too. Thanks for watching.